vlog. So, as usual, and dito pa rin si Inday Buntis. Umorder na lang ako ng food kasi si Frank po hindi siya uuwi sa lunch. Kaya umorder ako nitong tortilla. Yan. Ah, ano na ako ngayon, Zai? Umabot na ako sa point na tinatamad na ako mag um, magluto. So, nag-order na lang ako kasi ayaw kong magluto. Tapos wala lang ulam. Yung natira na lang is yung steak para dapat kay Frank po. Okay. Tinatawad ako lumabas, although nag-walking na naman kami ni Kuya Cooper kanina. So, nag-ayos si Inday Buntis kasi 2 days ako nakapagpahinga. O, oh, ba 2 days ako nakapagpahinga sa pagbablog. And then, 2 days na rin akong laging tulog na lang. <laughs> sa ba Andito lang ako sa bahay, laging natutulog. So, ayan, kain tayo ng lunch. Mga untag lunch, jay super healthy nito. Ito yung um, ito yung mga pag nati-take away na ako ng food, tinatry ko naman healthy. Ayan. I paid around 11 pounds at a little bit. Medyo mahal siya pero carry lang. Uy. Almost 1,000 pesos sa isang ganito. Diba? Mahal no? Hindi pa, pa, hindi pa kasama yung delivery fee dyan. Ay, but Tingnan nyo naman, super healthy. Meron siyang avocado, Mexican rice. Mmm. Mmm. Sarap. Tsaka healthy pa. At least kahit nag take away kami ni baby, di ba? Healthy pa rin yung kinakain. Late na ako nag-lunch kasi late na kami bumango ni Cooper. Si Cooper, nag-aantayin sa akin. Sabi siya sa akin mag-breakfast. Kasi si Frank po nagigising niya ng 8 a.m. Hmm. Anyway, magta-touch up ako ng um, mga gamit ni Baby. Yung mini nursery niya. Ilalagay ko na yung bed sheet. Tapos yung hospital bag. Yung gagamitin na lang namin is yung gym bag ni Franco para hindi na magamit ng maliit na maleta. Mm. Mm! Nahulog yung chorizo dahi. Si Kuya Cooper nakaabang. Buti lang super bright nito. Pag may mga nahuhulog sa sahe, hindi niya agad, agad kinukuha. Super well trained talaga nito ni Cooper. May mga bagay siyang ginagawa na hindi naman naman siya tinuruan. Pero, nakakagulat. Like, pag nag-walking kaming dalawa kasi, pag nag-walking kami, ina-unleash ko na siya sa mga area na walang tao or wala masyadong sasakyan. Pinaantay niya talaga ako. Super bait talaga ni Cooper. Feeling ko parang alam na alam niya ba na buntis ako dahil na nun. Nalamit ka ayon. Mexican food. So, Jai, natulog kami ni Cooper. Grabe. <laughs> after kong kumain kanina, mga after 30 minutes, natulog ako kasi as usual, antukin na talaga ako. Grabe yung antok, no? Oh! Ito ding isa. <laughs> Ito ding isa. Tulog din siya. Wala siyang pakialam, Jai. Hi, si... Papakita ko pala sa inyo itong ano, itong binigay ng aking midwife na during my last check-up three days ago. Ito ba ito? I parenting and feeding from conception to weaning. Ayan. So, binigyan niya ako ng brochure na ganito. Binigyan niya ako ng brochure na ganito para basa-basahin ko daw. Ayan. So, para, ano ba ito? Hindi ko pa nga ito nabasa eh. Information dito. Pregnancy knowing what happened after birth. How is milk made? Oh. Laban lang tayo kung may gata si Inday Joanna. Pero she also educate me that, you know, yung gatas hindi yan basihan sa kung gaano kalaki yung coco melon mo, Zai. Kasi sinabi ko talaga sa kanya yan, like, I'm aiming for breastfeed. Pero paano pag ano, paano pag uh, wala akong gatas kasi maliit daw yung 
kokomelon ko or wala akong kokomelon sa iba. Sabi niya, no, it's not about the size. Kasi, um, ano daw, siya nga, yung midwife ko, super liit din ang kokomelon niya. Pero yung gatas niya, para daw siyang cow, ang dami niya daw gatas. And I also have one friend na super liit din ang kokomelon. Parang akin ba? Hmm. Konti lang talaga nung namigay yung, ano, nung, nam, nung namigay ng kokomelon, absent ako or tulog ako nun tayo. Ito, ito para yung parang, uh, para makahelp na mag-avoid na mag-ano ka, mag-tear sa panganganak kasi di ba if you're aiming for vaginal um, birth, ayan, may nakalagay dyan paano yung massage ang ating perlas ng silanganan. <laughs> Ipapak ko na lang tong hospital bag ko kasi kailangan ko maglinis dito by tomorrow. May viewing na naman dito bukas. So, maglinis-linis muna ako saglit, no? Ito na lang yung dadalhin kong hospital bag. Malaki naman siya. Actually, ito yung ginagamit ko sa work. Um, I know, Samsonite na yung brand nito. Sa work ko to. Sa, this is from my company, Scandinavian Airline. So, binibigyan niya kami, nila kami ng ganitong bag. Uh, topper bag sa taas ng aming maleta. So, medyo malaki naman siya. So, ito na lang yung anuhin ko. Uh, gagamitin ko. Hospital bag. Kasi, ayoko nang mag-antay ng so, ayoko nang mag-antay ng maleta namin na tinampak sila mga makikin. Napis ni baby. Lalagay ko. Sakto naman to eh. Ah. Mami Snappies in the Joanna Spad. Ayan. And wipes. What else? Toiletries. Itataas ko muna ito kasi parang may ilalagay pa akong toiletries dito. Blank blanket ni baby na may customized name. Body suits. Ayan. Meron din dito ang dirty 3 months and newborn na body suits. Nakita ko na ito sa inyo nung nagpack ako ng aking hospital bag. Muslins and swaddle. Ayan. Oh, sakto lang. As in. Tapos going home outfit. Tapos going home outfit ko na. Okay rin lang naman pala. Sakto lang siya dahil eh. Ang cute talaga ng going home outfit ni baby. Oh, sakto lang. Kapak ko na ito. Tapos, ito na lang toilet trays. Meron naman mga basic dito, shampoo, etc. Taas ko na muna ito. Para just in case ba. Ready na ito. Dakuti ni... Wala. Struggle siya isarado dahil. <laughs> Struggle siya isarado. Ayun ko kasi magdala ng malaking malito. Bakit yung ibang mga nanay na nakikita ko sa umulit, ang liit lang ng bag nila? na ano, dinadala nila sa hospital. Mas maliit pa dito sa bag na pinili ko. Ay, bag. Konting ano na lang yun dyan. Tatagilid ko yun. Lalagay ko yun dun sa may ano natin. Sa Ooh. Hingal na ako dyan. Naglaba ako kanina mga damit ko. I realize ba, wala talaga akong damit dito. Pabalik-balik lang talaga yung damit ko. Inakahanap ako ng dress. Ito, maternity dress na nahanap ko kanina. Buti na lang. Push natin ang ating... Oh, itong kokomelon ko ba? Medyo lumaki pa nga itong kokomelon ko, Jay. Konti. <laughs> o, oh, ba Happy na ako sa ganito. <laughs> Sana all. Medyo lumaki na nga siya. Tapos yung nipple ko sobrang ano na. Sobrang uh, masakit na yung nipple ko. Buti na lang. Kahit maliit yung kokomelon ko. Kahit wala akong kokomelon. Yung nipple ko, pa-open siya ba? Makikita mo talagang pa-open. So, may mga nakikita ako parang milky-milky. I'm not sure kung sign na ba yun. But yes, that's done. Tomorrow, I'm going to clean here. Hi, Coop! How are you? Are you okay? You okay, baby? You okay? <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Hi, boy! <laughs> Natulog.
tulog din yan. Super pagod yan kasi grabe yung walking niya kanina. Hi, boy. Where's daddy, boy? Where's daddy? Bagong ligo. Yan kahapon. Niliguan ang mami niya. Kuya Cooper. Super bango-bango. Ang lambot-lambot. Ang lambot-lambot. Ang lambot. So, ayun nga pala na-install ko na tong ano ni baby. Uh, baby monitor niya. So, you can see. So, nagaganyan siya. Nafi-flip yung camera. Tapos, na-install na ko na din yung app. So, anytime ready na yan. Magpa-final ano ako dito. Magpa-final dusting para make sure. And meron din pala siyang sleep sensor pad. So, gagamitin ko to pag labas ni baby. So, basically, lagi mo siya under the mattress and then it, it can track sa mga move ni baby. Kahit konting move lang, notify ka ng um, app. So, for example, diba? Super useful nito. Super. Ang ganda ng ano nito. Ang ganda ng device na to. Super, ay, flat, like, flat na flat lang siya. Tapos, ilalagay mo siya sa baba ng mattress. So, para sa mga paranoid na mga ina dyan, ito. Habang may ginagawa kayo. And, super ganda ng ano na to. Sobrang ganda ng baby monitor na yan. Kasi, may music siya. Tapos, nakakatrack din siya ng temperature sa loob ng kwarto. So, super perfect yan. Nandiyan na lahat. Baby monitor. May music. Tapos, meron din siyang temperature tracker. So, itong binigay sa akin na ano. Ayan o. Oh, hindi ko na lang siya i-install dyan. Kasi madami nang abubot masyado. Ibibigay ko na lang to. O, sino interested dito o? Oh. Sa inyo na today, o, oh, sayang naman. Maganda pa naman sana siya. Kaso natatakot ako sa music. Hmm. Nakatakot yung music dahil parang horror. <laughs> Lalagi ko dito sa box. Ang daming box na... May box dito na mga gamit ni baby na hindi ko na nagagamit. So, ibibigay ko na lang to. Ayan, kung may mabigyan ako dito. Ayan, ito, binigay lang din to. Meron na siyang ganito, ibigay ng lola niya. Ayan, oh. Pamigay natin yan sa mga nangangailangan. Next one, hindi ko pa siya na-design itong balloon. Huh? Kasi kailangan ng hook. I might put it there. So, gagamitin ko to. Box ng printer dyan. Ay, ang daming ano. And I think, napakita ko na ata to sa inyo. Baby sling. Hindi ko pa siya na, ano, nabuksan. But, this is how it looks. Of the free riders to, pa-i-attach ko yung Instagram nila just in case you're interested to purchase kung dito kayo sa UK. Number one sling to dito sa UK. But, i-update ko kayo kung maganda ba tong sling na to. Kasi hindi ko pa nga siya nagamit. Pagdating na ni baby, mga bedsheet niya, yung bedsheet baka next week ko na lang. Ia, ano, para fresh na fresh yung bedsheet ni baby oh. Yung bedsheet niya tapos itong pantulog niya is matchy matchy. Matchy matchy dai. Bedsheet sa kanyang diaper. Ang bango. Ang bango ng pagkalaba ko. Perfect. Perfect in thy Joanna. Ready ah. ready na talaga ako maging nanay dai. Hapit na jud dai. Napipress ko na si baby. Hanggang dito na siya sa gitna. So, masakit na naman yung anak ko kagabi. Yung puson ko. And, yung balakang ko dito. Bumalik na naman siya. So, I am almost 36 weeks. <sighs> Hapit na. 36, 37. Pwede na mga anak si Inday Joanna. Woo! Isang linggo na lang. Let's see kung lalabas siya ng 37. Ba't kinakausap ko si baby? Kung gusto mong lumabas ng 37, anak mo walang problema, go lang. ba? Yung ate ko, yung sa Switzerland, yung mama ni Sasa, nanganak siya ng 36 weeks and 5 days. So, parang 2 days premature si Sasa, pero wala naman siyang problema. Super liit daw ni Sasa, parang bote lang daw ng Coca-Cola. Grabe, imagine, no? Ay. What's that, boy? Come on. Come on. 
Ce mă legă la? Ce mă legă la? Finally, makapagluto na ako ng dinner. So, pinapa... Pinabili ko si Fran ko ng tahong. Kasi sawang-sawa na ako sa chicken, pork. Wala na day. For today is, ito yung ulam natin. Tahong. Naghiwa na ako ng ano, garlic, onion, and ginger. Let's cook this. Sobrang dali lang nito. Basically, parang initin mo lang. Parang lutuin mo lang talaga yung, ano, yung tahong. Inantay ko pa si Franco kasi nag-gym ang dodong Franco natin. Pumili si Franco ng olive oil. Olive oil. Are you gonna eat this for dinner as well? Yeah, it's full of the morning, huh? So after work, he went straight to the gym as usual. Na LLS, na LSS. Ang laki na ng braso ko. Oh, parang akong boxidor dahi. First time. Ganito kalaki yung braso ko. Di ba parang akong boxidor dahi. Laban lang sa'yo. So far naman, wala naman nagmanas sa akin. Like yung mga paa ko, hindi naman siya nagmanas. Yung napansin ko lang yung braso ko, lumaki. Sirip siguro dahil kain na ako ng kain this last trimester. Kaya yan. Pero it's okay rin kahit lumaki pa yan. I don't care! Magbalik alindog na lang tayo pag nakaraos na. Sobrang sarap nito. White Scottish Mussels. Tsaka mayroon na siya. Mayroon na siyang sabaw. Put this on that? Yeah. Ayan na. Luto na ang tahong ni Enday Joanna. Kain tayo. Super gutom na ako, Zai. May hikop. Kain tayo, guys. Super gutom na ako. Tingnan nyo naman yung mukha ko. As in, matagal ka tinatapos yung isa. Kaya budi na naman si Inday. Mmm! May isa dahi. Nakasawa na kasi talaga yung manok. Puro chicken, pork, chicken, pork. Lilipad na kami dito. Mmm! Namiss ko na yung mga ano, mga fresh na isda sa Pilipinas. Siguro mga kauwi kami mga November or December ulit sa Pasko. Let's see. Basta mga after 3 months, kuhan ko na ng passport si baby girl. Para anytime pwede na siya mag-travel. Wala, ang sarap na takong uwi. Afin. Tapos yung sauce niya po. Sarap. So guys, Joanna just got upset for a little while. She has this third trimester. I've noticed that she has kind of little emotional breakdowns. Yeah. Mmm, don't sit that long. Huh? So Joanna had no food in the fridge, and she texts me saying she's hungry. So I finished the gym early so I can get her some food, and then um, yeah, she's uh literally just came back now she was just vlogging a second ago and then she started crying i said what's wrong she said i'm so hungry i was like there's food there already he said yeah but i had no food and then she told me to go away <laughs> oh my god she's laughing now this is what i mean guys if you're a guy out there and you had a pregnant filipino woman before please can you relate to me okay Why are you upset then? Huh? <laughs> so yeah, yeah, it's uh, you have to be a bit more understanding when Joanna's like this. I don't even want to be like this. Yeah, why not? I think I my theory, <laughs> my theory is is she has a button downstairs <laughs> and she's pressing the buttons like attack him, attack, 
Schau ihm! Schau ihm! Guck von, von ihm, von Talent to buy some food! They came to the point now that I'm tired. Is it? Everything's heavy. Well, it's not normal to go now, isn't it? There's only a few weeks. Um, and Joanna is obviously feeling a bit tired. She's. Do comment down below sa mga buntis na I don't know if it's just me like this. Like, every time I'm starving, I'm just. I'm very emotional. I don't know. It's worse this third trimester, isn't it? Mm, it's worse. The thing is, Joanna doesn't give me any notice. <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, I'm hungry. Hey, go! Give me some now! Where are you? Give me food now! I'm hungry! I'm so hungry! <laughs> <laughs> she was, you was crying when you was eating. You was going. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, why did you cry? What happened to the food? In of ko yung vlog kasi nga naiiyak ako, so I turned off the vlog and then I cried. <laughs> <laughs> she turned it off. I said, no, let's turn it on so they can see what's going. Uh, you only one minute crying, one minute laughing. I don't know what to expect. No, the thing is, I don't like when I'm hungry. I don't, and I don't have anything here, and I was waiting for Franco. Did try my best to come home as fast as I can. Um, there are speed limits on the road, so I can't go over them. But next time, I think I'll have to break those speed limits to come home faster. <laughs> and guys, I've got a story. This uh, this beginning of this week, and she just left the packets there empty. <laughs> no. Can't believe how. How, uh, what's it called? Mm. How much you eat. It's like a rhinoceros. Rhinoceros, yeah. What's that? Elephant. What? They're like whale. Come here, dear. Poor you. Poor dear. Poor <laughs> I can't believe you were crying while you were eating. <laughs> I think it was a mixture of how you were so hungry and how, how good it tastes. <laughs> it was like... Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was just talking to the vlog earlier and suddenly I turned it off and then I cried. <laughs> oh no. Don't worry, dear. I'm back. I'm back here now. <laughs> yeah, guys, so whoever's pregnant, like I'm sure one of you, or many of you watching this vlog, are pregnant right now. Um, Joanna's in her third trimester. And third dress me, I'm almost there. Yeah, so she's very emotional now. She's very tired. She just wants it to come out, all the baby to come out. <laughs> and uh, yeah, she's very up and down, mood swing all the time. Um, so just let me know how you girls are feeling, whatever trimester you are. You have to be quite patient. Um, you have to be a bit more understanding in comparison to when she wasn't pregnant. So it's uh, the first time Franco didn't understand. The pregnancy hormone. Who advised you? Google advised me. Who advised me? Did you Google or your sister advised you? No, not my sister. Who was it? Someone advised me. Oh, I think it was a colleague. Call well. Call your, yeah, many people advised me actually. Yeah. Mm. What your colleague says then? Said, um, just be patient, <laughs> be caring, always make sure there's food in the fridge. <laughs> That's the thing. This is twice now that Franco left me hungry. Thing is, I don't get any notification, guys. It's literally a phone call. It's of like 20 missed calls. <laughs> I'm at the gym and I saw 20 missed calls. I thought, yeah, she's hungry. <laughs> the, the, hip, the hippopotamus is hungry. Hippopotamus. <laughs> the hippo. This is how the hippo get. This is how the hippo realizes she's hungry. Look, she goes. I can't control my emotion. I can't control my emotion today. Like suddenly I just cry. <laughs> Especially when I'm hungry. I mean, only right now. First, second trimester, I'm, I'm very good. Yeah, first, second trimester, you're okay, aren't you? Mm, just right now, I'm not picking up on my neck. Joanna's eating more than me these days. I'm not eating 90 kilo. <laughs> Joanna. <laughs> 
Look at me, I'm fat na nga. Mm. Ha? Huh? Oh, taba na lang, no? Tumaba na nga ako. Cause normal eh. It's okay, it's normal because I'm pregnant, isn't it? You are beautiful in my eyes. <laughs> Even when you're hungry and crying. <laughs>